Hey there, welcome to this video tutorial for Johnny Be Good, one of my favorites. Um, this is a song by Chuck Berry, and even though I've put this in our blues uh, unit, this song is really kind of rock and roll. But if you uh, take a look at your chord chart, you'll notice that uh, it follows almost exactly the 12 bar blues pattern. So it's very, it's like blues infused rock, I suppose. Um, let's take a quick look in to uh, just double check the chords we're going to play in this song. We're in the key of G, so let's take a look. In the key of G for this blues-infused rock song, as we've said, uh, we need the G chord like this. Point your fingers on the second fret of the C string. Middle finger comes back here to the second fret of A, and then I have to kind of scooch my ring finger in between the two to the third fret of the E string. Um, and what I'm going to do, a, if you want to do a blues shuffle on the key of G, I strum down here, and then I lift that ring finger up, put it back down. Like that. That's how I'm going to go for my regular G to that shuffle. I also need the C chord, which we all know and love. Just a reminder of that shuffle. I go down and then I add the pointer finger to the second fret on G. Oh, one, two, three, four. And then the third chord I need in this song is D7. I play with my middle and ring like this. It's basically like a regular D chord, but it's missing this, uh, this string right in here. It's kind of an open string there. So that sounds kind of nice. You can also play it like this if you want, or like this. I tend to feel most comfortable with the ring in the middle here like that. And there's no shuffle on that one, just straight strums when you get to that D7. All right, here we go. We're gonna start on G, add that shuffle right away if you like. Let's just run through the chord progression for the verse first, then we'll go back and add the words. Starting on G, here we go. A one, two, ready, and a one, two, three, four, two, chart that you don't have any chords above the lyrics so you're gonna want to refer to the chords from verse 1 and this is just a nice challenge for your musicianship to uh, really get this 12 bar blues ingrained in your fingers and in your mind as you follow it along here we go verse 2 one two three four one two here we go you used to carry his guitar in a gunny sack or sit beneath the tree G7 by the railroad Track. See the engineers and see him sitting in the shade. Back to G, strumming with the rhythm that the drivers made. D7, people passing by, they would stop and say, G, oh my, but that little country boy could play. Go, go, back to the chorus. Go, Johnny, go, go, go. G7, go. Oh 
leaves it so unresolved. All right, feel free to go back and use this video as much as you need to play along, to kind of watch what I'm doing. And also, um, as I said, this is a great opportunity to memorize that pattern of the verse. You just play those three verses in a row, same pattern for the chorus. So it's a good, good test of your musicianship that you don't have all the chords on that chord chart there. Um, enjoy your practice. I'll see you around the next video.